pun. I'm sorry, I'm just trying to think how to make that sound not stiff, but... Why did you decide to study computer? No, we already done this. Um, I'm going to start from the beginning of that, sorry. Um, <laughs> Hi, my name is Gianluca De Martini. I'm a computer scientist and associate professor at the School of ITEE at the University of Queensland. And I'm here with Zarin, who's a third year computer science student. And we are here to answer some questions. Thank you. Um, I think I've got the first question. What is computer science? Computer science is uh, the field uh, looking at the theory and applications of uh, computing uh, technologies across different domains. Why did you decide to study computer science? In high school I was studying ICT um, and I enjoyed it quite a lot. So it seemed uh, natural for me to study either an IT or computer science degree uh, at uni. So I started uh, researching what is computer science. Um, and around that time, I started hearing words like cyber attack and cyber security in the media and um, movies and TV shows. Um, and I started to realise how important cyber security is um, to protecting our way of life. So, um, yeah, that's why I decided to choose what I wanted to study. Why did you choose the University of Queensland? I chose UQ because um, it was important that I could also study criminology in addition to computer science. Um, at the time, UQ hadn't announced that they were doing a computer science degree. Um, and then one day, my, uh, the careers advisor at school um, emailed me saying, UQ has a computer science degree and um, I found out there was a cybersecurity major in it and that was so exciting. Um, and then I found out I could pair it with a Bachelor of Arts, um, which has the Criminology major. Um, and it was everything just fell into place. That was the exact combination I was looking for. Um, so it really it wasn't a tough decision at all. Who should study computer science? So everyone who has an interest in digital innovation should study computer science, but not only the geeks, right? Uh, I think you are a perfect example of how computer science can be applied to any domain and sector to really bring innovation and, and, and technology to, to change how things are done. And, and criminology is, uh, is one of such fields where computer science methodologies can be applied to really scale up the methods that otherwise uh, are not really applicable to, to, every, to very large amounts of data. What is the difference between computer science, IT and software engineering? So UQ has degrees in all of these three uh, disciplines. I think a degree in computer science uh, uh, gives you the foundation of, uh, of computing as well as uh, looks at advanced topics. Uh, and a degree in uh, IT looks more at uh, applications of information technology to, to different domains. Uh, and uh, a software engineering degree is uh, an engineering degree, as the name implies. So you are going to do all the engineering foundations uh, as well if you do a software engineering degree. Any advice to high school students interested in computer science? Yeah. Um... When I first started at uni, I realised that I was really behind everyone else. I didn't know much about programming. I didn't even know what functions and parameters were. So um, the first semester was a huge jump for me and I really struggled. Um, and yeah, it can be really intimidating um, when all your peers seem to have so much more experience than you. So my advice would be to not let other people intimidate you. Um, you, will, you will get there one day and when I look back to my first year, um, I have come a long way and I've learned so much. What career opportunities are there? So computer science is one of the most uh, uh, requested type of skill at the moment. It's in the top five uh, jobs uh, in Australia that look at automation, artificial intelligence. So students who graduate uh, in a computer science degree 
uh, we love skills uh, uh, which are in high demand and we love the opportunity to work uh, either for the uh, big uh, technology corporations but as well as uh, in other fields, right? And bring uh, innovation, digital innovation to other fields as well. Does the university have any industry connections? Uh, yes, uh, quite a few. So for students, we get uh, a lot of uh, support from uh, uh, industry. For example, we get uh, from the key cloud computing providers like Amazon and Google. Uh, resources for students to use during their studies and also in the research space uh, uh, for example myself I have a project with uh, Facebook to uh, fight the spread of misinformation in social media which is a very important uh, topic at the moment so I'm very happy to work with them uh, to, to solve these issues. What is your dream job? So I, you know, the thing is, whenever I think about this, I wonder if maybe, you know, there's a job that is my dream job, but it ha doesn't exist yet. Yeah, I think that's one of the good problems of uh, studying computer science is not whether you will find a job, it's whether you deciding which one you really want to do. <laughs> yeah, it's so difficult because it is so wide. Um, I mean, computer science is quite a wide field and it's obvious in the majors available um, in the computer science degree, but even in cyber security, there's so many different professions, so many different roles. It's hard to tell. Um, next question is, what do you most enjoy about teaching computer science at UQ? I like that we give uh, students uh, uh, hands-on projects, so we give them real-world data sets and problems to work on and this gives them uh, uh, experience of what they will see later on uh, when they get a job. Uh, so I try not to just uh, uh, show them uh, examples but really work uh, on real problems uh, so they see what will be the challenges uh, once they uh, do uh, computer science uh, outside the university. And this is the last question. What does the future of this industry look like? So computer science is a very dynamic field um, and every few years there is a revolution. Um, so it's very hard to predict, but uh, uh, we have seen how um, the internet, artificial intelligence, uh, uh, big data, internet of things have been and will be changing the way we, we live and we work in the future. Uh, so there will be for sure um, um, other big changes uh, uh, due to computer science. And for you not knowing which uh, job or career you want to take, uh, this means you will have the opportunity to, to, to do something for a few years and then possibly decide to change uh, if you want to try something else. So that's also a, a positive of computer science.